Hey guys, it's CamoFighter1234 here, and I got take two of my unboxing of my Gemini Jets Alaska Boeing 737-900ER, honoring those who serve. And my Gemini Jets, uh, British Airways Boeing 747-400, um, from the airplane shop, guys. Uh, let me just quickly open this. Set that down right here. I didn't finish cutting in my video cut out. So... Here it is. Let's take the plastic off. And first is the Alaska. There it is. Put that down. And actually, I I ordered the seven four seven, but I guess it's the uh, 777, I'll have to double check on that order. And here's the beautiful model. There it is. And let's quickly do the unboxings for them. Let's hold that right there. Hang on, let me just quickly check the order form. Let me just put it down right here. I'm sorry, guys. Just to the box with that stupid tape thing. All right then, I guess I ordered the triple seven. There's the total. Okay then. Um, first we will do the Alaska 737-900 ER on a nose reserve. And uh, here's the front of the box. Gemini Jets made for collectors by collectors. Alaska 737-900 ER. 1400 scale diecast model. There's bottom, side, the top. I just hate how these stick out and you can't put them back in. The, the bottom, I mean the other side, and then the back, 2017 Gemini just released, and here is that, you guys can pause and read it right there, and there was a beautiful model, um, my first 737-900 uh, with uh, split scimitars, uh, really love this model. I had to pick it up. It was between this model or the Delta 777-900ER with splits. And I opted to go with this one because I, I don't have a uh, Alaska model yet. And I like it how they put the plastic on top and below the aircraft. So it doesn't the paint or anything doesn't scratch. And it's a very beautiful model, uh, very highly detailed. And I love the split scimitars. And then the registration is November 265 Alpha Kilo. And the bottom of the aircraft. I'll do a more in depth review later on. Uh, this is just an unboxing, guys. And then this mistakenly ordered British 777. There's the model. You guys can pause and read it. And there's that. And then the bottom, side, front, or top, and then the other side. And then the back. Uh, it's 2015 release, airplane climbing. Um, let's just open this. Just take a look right there. At least this plane comes with antennas. I gotta give it that. At least it comes with antennas. Gotta open it one-handed here. Let's see if we can do it. So far, it doesn't look like it's working. Let's try. 
two. Let's just put that down here. I'm sorry. Uh, and this model is so perfectly packaged, it doesn't need to come with plastic. There it is. It is a very great model, though. I have to give it that. It's a beautiful model. Just wish it came better packaged. And there is the model. I do have uh, many Phoenix 777, so I'll also do a comparison between them. See which mold is more. Got the lighting. So bad. To see which one's a better mold. That's sort of better. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. There it is. The registration. Come on. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Wrong button. Uh, the registration is is golf. Uh, <laughs> actually, I can't say that. It's uh, G S T B G. I forgot what S stands for, so that's why I couldn't do the that sort of alphabet, the military alphabet. And underbelly of the aircraft. And guys, so that's the unboxing of these two beautiful models. Still like the Alaska better. Um, but guys, please comment, rate, subscribe, and thank you for tuning to this failed unboxing. Thank you. Camo out.